Landfall's the largest of this map pack, but it's still small enough to play 4v4. It's going to seem a little bit similar to the pit from Halo 3. You've got an interior structure that has multiple levels and a couple ins and outs so that you can drop down and engage people in different ways. But the excitement comes through the outer areas of the map. It's a really balanced map, so you can definitely play all ball and uh, some CTF on it as well. We're debuting a new game mode called Infinity Rumble, a very focused free-for-all experience that lets you call in ordnance. No matter what mode you're playing on Landfall, I definitely expect teams to rush for those rockets right away. They're in an open area towards the back of the map. Whatever team does grab those rockets generally gets control of the map, and depending on the mode, can go to a huge lead. The definite challenge that players are going to face when they play on Landfall is choosing a loadout that really fits well in all parts of the map. My best tips on that one is if you have a close quarters weapon, like an SMG or a shotgun style, stay indoors. But if you've got like the binary rifle or DMR, make sure you take advantage of those long sight lines outdoors to sort of lock people in the buildings. The armor abilities that you choose are really going to dictate where you play. So if you are a jetpack player, there's a ton of room on the outside of the map to really get around, get an angle. But you always have those cut-throughs through the center structure. 